Hello friends, today I am going to share with you how you can bypass FRP lock on Galaxy A20 and the other version is 11. So first of all go to YouTube and search for Alliance Shield X Faisal. As you can see I am at YouTube and I am searching here Alliance Shield X Faisal. And then you will see the first video how to create Alliance Shield X account, how to backup Alliance Shield X in your Samsung account for FRP. So watch this. If you don't know how to create backup of Alliance Shield X in Samsung account, first watch this video, then come back to your device, open Samfirm tool and connect mobile and select bypass FRP, empty bypass FRP, click on it. And this will show a pop-up message on your mobile screen. So just wait for it, as uh, you can see, pop-up message appear on your mobile screen. Now click on the view button. If this tool doesn't work for you, please disable driver signatures first, then try again. So here you can see, now we are in our Google Chrome. Just click on accept and continue, no thanks and now we are in browser here we need to search for frp facel as you can see i am just searching here frp facel and the first link click on it this will let you go to my website so here you need to scroll down and open galaxy store click here now this will ask for the update and you need to update it, agree. Click on the update button and it can take a few minutes, depend on your internet speed. So I just make it fast forward so we can finish it fast. As you can see, it's updated now. Again, open Galaxy store. And now this will, it will be open. So just click on the search, search button and type here as 9 launcher theme and we need to download it. So give your Samsung account here. If you don't have Samsung account, please create Samsung account first. And I am just going to give my Samsung account here. And here I will give my password and click done. Now it will ask for the verification, so we need to verify it, agree. Now this will send a verification code on your registered mobile number, so wait for it, I have got it. So I just put it here and verify it. As you can see, our account is signed in. And now our file will begin to download, allow. S9 launcher is now installing. When it will install, you just need to open it directly. Just wait a few seconds. It's installing now. Now install anyway. Now it's almost done. Now just click on the play button to open it and give permission. Continue. Press continue. And now we are in our mobile and give the permission click on ok button here now just click on enter ok as you can see now we are in our mobile go to menu settings button now go to account and backup and here we need to restore data click on it now we need to update it click on the update button it can take a few minutes so we just need to wait for it i just try it again it's working or not updated 
yes it's fine now now click on the backup you have got now click on the arrow button and here we just need to install the align shield x so i will select only align shield x so click on the done button restore install so it can take a few seconds to install the align shield x so be calm and wait for to installation finish yeah you can see it's 100 percent done now click on the done button later so we just need to go back go back again go back to the home screen click on the menu button and here you can find align shield x click on it to open it click next next and here we need to give our align shield x username and password so i have already registered on it so give password over here and now just click on the next button turn on device admin activate it now click next again click on the knocks to open it and now confirm as you can see our Knox security is going to enable it's successfully enabled now click on the finish button it's not working click on the finish button yes fine now click on the app manager now click on the close button and here we need to search for service mode click on the service button and search here service mode scr vic service mode mode so click here and now click on the activities and just scroll down at the bottom one two three service mode and open it and here we need to select mtp plus adb and that's all now our phone is enabled adb mode so we can reset our frp lock in adb mode for that just connect your mobile again with the pc and open same firm tool in computer so i am just going to computer again and as you can see our adb interface is now installing the drivers and that's all now select adb in sam firm and reset frp now it will ask for the permission from your mobile just give the permission and this will reset your frp lock so wait for the permission a pop-up message will appear on your mobile it's just connecting with the phone now just wait a little bit as you can see here is the pop-up message click on it allow again click on the allow button and again i select allow so you can see it's just connected now and this will reset frp lock click on the allow button again and the phone will be restart as you can see phone is now just restarting and our frp lock is gone so just wait for to restart the phone it can take a few seconds so just wait for it this method works on any samsung phone which have android 11 and uh, one ui 3.1 you can use this method and if you bypass frp lock 
successfully please do comment in the comment section with the date so other people also can get help from your comment and hopefully i will pin your comment so as you can see our phone is started up successfully we just need to select the interface so i just select samsung interface wait for a second so if it's blinking so you just wait for a few seconds then phone will start as you can see just click on the no thanks and wait for a few seconds this will automatically start up as you can see phone started up successfully now go to settings and account and backup you need to remove your account samsung account then you need to hard reset your mobile factory data reset so go to reset and factory data reset your mobile and all done hopefully you like the video if you like the video do subscribe like and share see you in the next video till then bye bye allah hafiz